Yes. Eh? <laughs> I wanna break to you. <laughs> I wanna break to you. <laughs> I wanna break to you. <laughs> Hi guys, what's up? Good morning. So yesterday, Kidwire and Prince were evicted from the BB Ninja lockdown house. Hello guys, welcome back again to my channel. My name is Vicky and if you see me for the very first time, hi, please consider to hit on that red subscribe button and join my family, join my gang of friends, my clique of friends. I really love to have you guys on the channel. Thank you so very much. So guys, I just can say I should bring a quick one to you guys. Well, after the eviction, this was the first video of Prince outside the house. Hello everybody, my name is Prince and I've just been evicted from the Big Brother house. First of all, I want to say a very big thank you to God, to my family, and to every single person that has been a part of my journey. That's my fans, to Royal you Navy. I'm very thankful to you guys. You guys have been amazing, keeping me in the house for this long. I never expected it to get this long, to get this far into the show, but you guys, I'm very, very grateful. You don't know how much it means to me. This was um, a wish I made nine years ago to be on this show, and I came on this show and you guys kept me this long. I will never forget it. I will appreciate you all, you guys, all the, way, all the days of my life, and God bless all of you. And then moving on, it was also time for um, Kidwire to also bring us his first video. And Kidwire promised us his fan that he's going to, you know, there's something for us, his fan. So here is Kidwire's video. Hi guys, my name is Kidwire and I've just been evicted from the Big Brother house. But it's all good, it's all good. I'm very excited to be here right now with you guys. Shout out to all my fans. I love you guys so, so much. It would not be possible without you, your prayers, your strengths, your blessings. So I do all of this for you. I promise we've got a lot of work to be done, but we will get there and I'll have a surprise for all of you guys. Love you so much. Take care. Stay blessed. And then moving on, guys, a lot of people, like few people I saw on the internet reacted to Kidwire's eviction. Even though me, I actually felt bad about it because I did not see it coming. In fact, when he, when they said Dorothy was safe and then um, it was just Ozo and Kidwire, in my mind, I was like, hi, Ozo is gone, no. And then, boom, Ibuka said it was Kidwire that was evicted. Guys, I was shook, like I was surprised, like I did not expect it, but... It is what it is at this very point. So Kidwire left and then Stan Clef, I don't know if he's now a, a blogger or something, but he was once a musician or something like that, had this to say. Um, now you guys will agree with me that Big Brother and only do a job. So this is my statistics. Now, Lekon already winged it 5 million naira. So congratulations to Lekon because every day Kidwire is gone. And Kidwire and I have a passport in game because when I try not like to the CC rich man became there for one, they follow and they compete. Poor people don't go agree. You understand? So Kidwire, your papa not for your game because your father not supposed to show himself to the world saying be billionaire. You understand? Because Nigeria don't want to hear that kind of game. But you did well though. And I love you, bro. You understand? But let go. Let go for the win. But yeah. Eh? The truth of the matter is that maybe not in that aspect that he's talking about, but I feel like, you know, when they said his father is rich, people just become like a desical, people just relax and be like, okay, in father, then go off. Of course, they, they got his back, they have money, everybody got his back, and that's just what will basically happen because a lot of people will feel like they have money, so people will do it, you get. So they just feel laid back from just, I am supporting his true fans, might just feel laid back or something like that. But it is what it is. After all, Kid Wire made it clear to us that he's not hustling for the money so i don't think there was a need him still staying in the house even though we really 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 missed him but i feel like a lot of people the people remaining in the house are people who are desperate for the money and i just hope that the best person actually win and then this there's a popular socialite on in river state but harcourt nigeria here of course that actually broke his tv in reaction to kid wires eviction i don't know whether it's a prank or not but that is just this is just was they actually posted? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I wanna break to you. <laughs> I wanna break to you. <laughs> I wanna break to you. <laughs> you see, nearly they mentioned Kidwire's name. He threw something to the TV, and I'm like, hmm. 
is this for clout or for what i don't know is this for clothes or for whatever it is i don't know what it is but that's just basically it and i don't understand truly the truth be told that i feel bad kid why i know who are the people remaining nengi also neo v and then lecon and trickity and people have been saying that if people that have the show or people that are making the show lively they've all gone then they are now leaving boring people in the house it is what it is the people you expect to get to the finals immediately they stand up and the the the, the competition is tough like that just like it was this week definitely our your favorite might definitely leave you but if they were standing with a weaker people like um, V and you I don't think they would have left but that's just what it is at this very point and then moving on guys after the eviction show Nengi and V they actually settled and they just talked about their differences how do we even have that stupid fight can we not fight again we can not try but the first fight is necessary mm -hmm. so we understand ourselves mm -hmm. that's what I said anyway I said, I won't say anything yes, because this is our first fight. <laughs> now I know that you're more stubborn than me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I am not. I actually think you are. Because mm -mm. mm -mm. you see me and you carry your small face. Mm. I see this Even during the show, I said, oh, we have the beautiful Nengi, Nengi, and your face was like... like. I'm just happy the way they handled the issue. I'm not, I'm not making it look as if, you know like extending it because you guys are few so why are you keeping malice why are you beefing why do you want to start quarreling it's not necessary at this point so i feel like they are settling their issue is just the very best at this very point in time so i'm happy they did settle their issue and they also spoke about people who who were bragging about having teams outside because shortly after the eviction the housemates gather and we we're talking about people that were bragging maybe they did not use the word brag but people that were actually confident of their teams outside Am I all the people that have teams that's it so good. This is a cup of tea. The cup of tea, my brother. Also, not getting now. No, at the end of the day, here, your faith is just in God and in, uh, in an Africa. 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 Mm -hmm. God and Africa. Like, your team. Not just Africa. Not just Africa. Africa. You call it's already. Not it's not really 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 um, Kid Wire was here telling, I think also that he's just he just feels pity for them because he trusts his team and then obviously his team did not come true and now even Tolani Ba said he had she had team of people she organized outside and then their team they are gone. So they were like the people that said they have team that were working for them outside, they are out of the house. And like I will always say, the, the, the whole thing about this baby Ninja is is that truly your faith lies in the hands of God and in the hands of Africans. Because no matter the team you gather up for them to see how things are going, if the masses of people are not supporting you, you're not going to pull through, you're not going to go far. Because you cannot depend on maybe you, you organize 20 people, you can't depend on them. But yes, it is also good to have people campaigning for you you get but at the end of the day it all depends on your game that you're playing inside the house that make other people who your team might not be able to reach out to to just like you to just want to support you to just want to be there for you you get and they keep voting for you but if you just want to depend on the campaign and the people who you kept outside to campaign for you to be there for you or more you know go work because you take lacon for example lacon i don't think even if lacon kept a team of people outside but lacon is a street person like the smallest person on the street knows the name lacon in fact some people know big brother through the name lacon you get some people want to watch it because everybody's just talking about lacon 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 you get and they just want to be like who's this person and then you watch the show and you just you just love him so just in fact uh, it's all grace at this point in time because if you're looking about team i don't think lacon would have gone far in the game but at this point now god's grace just you know shining upon him and then it's just looking or oh, in fact it's looking very obvious because the fact that kid wire is out of the way it's very obvious that lacon will be winning this show this year in fact bb niger belongs to the streets this year no cap nobody should you can't even argue you can't even drag so don't even bother because lacon is going home with 85 million era since kid wire its lay has gone and then also i'm not sure nengi mm, i don't really think so that's just basically that just felt like let me bring this out here to you guys i hope you enjoyed Please, if you do give it a thumbs up leave me a comment in the comment section i really love to hear from you guys and if you've not subscribed to my channel please 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 hey joe support my channel by subscribing please do not leave without subscribing and most importantly for all the new subscribers please 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 turn on your notification bell so that whenever i post a new video it will just be ringing in on your phone that ah, moments with vicky number one a proko madam has uploaded a video let me go and hear what she has to say thank you so very much for watching i really do appreciate you guys and our most 
definitely see you guys in my next video bye guys